Okay, in this question we've got a square base pyramid. A, B to C to D gives us a square. And the side of that is 6 metres. We're told A, B is 6 metres, so this side is 6 metres, this side and this side are all 6 metres. And the height, vertex above X is 5 metres, and X is in this same plane. So this is directly above this. So this will form a right angle with this plane. Anyway, we want to find the length AC. So let's look at our diagram in 3D a bit better. So we get AC across here. Let's hide that. AC is the length we're looking at, and we're going to use this triangle here. Let's just colour that in so we can see that a bit more easily. Let's make it something a bit more cheerful. There we go, something red. So that's the base we're going to look at. Now if we rotate our view round, so we're looking directly from above. There we go. We can see we get a right angle triangle. This side is 6, this side is 6, and we're looking for that side, and there's the right angle. So that's what we're going to use. So let's go ahead and do that. So we're going to find AC, and here's the triangle that we are dealing with. Let's label our triangle. So we're going to label this side C. Uh, we're going to label this side equal to A, and this one equal to B. Because Pythagoras' theorem states that A squared plus B squared equals C squared, and that is what we're going to use in our formula. So C is the always the side opposite the right angle, or the longest side, two ways for you to try and remember it, and A and B are either side of the right angle, and they're both going to be equal to 6 in this case. Let's just give ourselves a bit more space to work in. So, let's write it out. So, we've got A6 squared plus B, which is 6 squared, will give us C squared. So we've got 36 plus 36, which is 72. And that's C squared, so therefore we want to square root that to get our answer. So we could just re leave our answer in terms of third, 72. Or we can get our calculator and find out what our decimal answer is. So we'll do square root of 72 equals 6 root 2 if you want to cancel that down or 8.485. I tend to round to three significant figures although in this question we're only given two significant figures. So let's stick with the two significant figures given in this question. So it's 8.4 is two significant figures. Look at the third. It's 8. Okay. So that is above 5 uh, or equal to 5. If it's equal to 5 or above 5, we need to round up, so we'll get 8.5 as our answer here. So our answer here is 8.5 uh, metres. And that's our, that is our distance of A to C to 2SF. Two significant figures.